off the rim. Welcome back, everyone. I'm Nick. I'm Andy. And you're watching KFAF, a special holiday episode. It's Christmas in July and August, uh, ladies and gentlemen. And we thought, what better way to celebrate it than bringing back everyone's favorite show on the internet, KFAF. Yeah, it's really a tragedy that we were, we just found out that Mixer shut down. So we've been doing the show every week and for the past two, two-ish years, two and a half years, and we, nobody was watching. It, was, it <laughs> Which really is, was. isn't a whole change. It isn't a huge change from our past. No, you know, we were used to getting anyway. 500 views, so getting zero views was just like, okay, well, people just don't like us that much. Yeah. Um, you really, you really just kind of have to look around the, the the office and say to yourself, what does Roger do here? Why didn't he tell us Mixer was shut down two years ago? You know? Yeah. What, I, do, what do we pay Roger for if not to tell us what the cool, hip, new distribution platforms are? I feel like he'd I be on top so, of that. Yeah, you think so, right? Yeah, I don't know. He's the youngest guy here, so you think he'd tell us one day. Hey, we got the, the, the dude is also here. Oh yeah, joining us today in the basement is the dude. Say hi, dude. Yo, what up, dudes? Mary Dumas. Yeah, this is the. I was really happy to have you for this holiday. A lot of people that didn't even know Christmas in July was a thing, and then I started wondering, is that just a, an RGV thing? Because I'll tell you what, when you hit July, Nick, yeah. the amount of like Ford and Chevy truck dealership commercials talking about Christmas in July sale. So, like, was the plan initially to have this Christmas special in January? Yeah. A month late, funny. It's just we just don't have the time, man. You we know? Had, I mean, again, maybe we did, but it's lost to Mixer. It's lost. It's definitely lost out there. It's it's one of those things, Andy, that you start thinking to yourself. We could have nailed January. We talked about nailing Arbor Day, and then you said, <laughs> "No, Christmas. you mentioned Arbor Day once. <laughs> That's all it was." <laughs> and, then you, and then you said, "What if we did Christmas in July?" That's the thing, and I get really nervous whenever anyone in the office says that's a thing um, because I don't pay attention to anything. So I don't know if something's a thing or not. Here's a for example. I was at a show last night, Andy, and my friend said that she really likes lemons. So for her birthday party this year, she was throwing a lemon party. I didn't know. I was like, that sounds fun. And she goes, no, everyone's making fun of me because a lemon party is a thing. And I was like, I didn't know it was a thing. And then I Googled it. How do you not it's remember that from your past? I mean, this was like, at, this was at the the inception of the internet when you were about like 39 years old. Well, that's the problem. The longer the days go, the more data comes in here and goes, there's no space, and then it goes right back out. Isn't that right, dude? Dude. <laughs> er, I want to say, say that yesterday, <laughs> Nick said, uh, hey, Andy. He's a very, very solemn tone. He said, Andy, uh... Mm -hmm. You know, yesterday somebody called me Big Fella. Yeah, big guy. Big guy. He was like, "Is that cause, is that because I'm like I'm gaining weight?" I was like, "What do you mean?" And he's like, "Yeah, some guy just was like he saw me, somebody that I know, and said, hey, what's up, big guy?'" I walked into my jujitsu class, and one of my instructors, who hadn't seen me in a while, gave me a hug, and as he wrapped his arms around me, he goes, "Hey, what's up, big guy?" And it's not like when you call like like Kevin walks around, we call him Big Cat. It's a big cat. I call Mike big walks around. I call him Big Dog. Mm. What's up, Big Dog? Big Dog, right? That's a sign of respect. Saying in my life, you take up a lot of my my how life. Did, how did he get that wrong? <laughs> big Kev Dog, you know? Yeah. I call I call people Big Cat. Sure, but <laughs> like in general, not BKD just Kevin. BKD is like a known <laughs> nickname for me. Yeah. I mean, there's a couple other nicknames we have. For <laughs> Kevin. I can't we'll wait. see if those get make it to the Photoshop challenge today. I can't wait to re-explore those. I can't wait to re-explore uh, Ladies and gentlemen, that. of course, we have a wonderful show for you today. We're going to be going through all the hits of KFAF. Namely, we're going to play a game. We're going to do the Photoshop challenge. And we would be remiss if we didn't get out there on the court and rank something. And I'll give you one guess as to what we're going to rank. Dude, isn't that right? Do the do. God, he's working in like the smallest space as possible, but he's nailed, like he's he's, crushing he's hitting it. a thousand right now. He's batting a thousand. Mike literally goes, "What do you want me to do?" And I'm like, "I just want you to be the guy that's in everyone's basement who's the like, mom feeds." Mm -hmm. Is Michael here? Is he hungry? Yeah, he's pretty hungry. Fuck yeah, he is. Does he want? Does he? Does Michael want some uncrustables? Earlier he said, can I drink these dudes? And I said, absolutely you can. And he said, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to pound so much Code Red. You're talking to the guy who 
during the kind of munchies, demanded that he eat all nine of the <laughs> items. <laughs> it was a lot, ladies and gentlemen. It was a lot. Yeah. Andy, should we go right into it? Should we should we kick it off with the game of Jenga? Yeah. Do you have the yeah? Do you have the jump set? Yeah. All right. Here we go. You got to shake off the rust. Okay. It, it sure. works. Is it, everything working? Come on, hear the noise, girls. Rock your boys. That's not the song I wanted you to play. I want do do. <laughs> no, do, no, do. no. Just hit, hit me with the do. Do, oh, do, you want to do? do. You have, okay, I require you to say to officially request it by saying, "Hey, DJ Nick, drop that nasty beat." DJ Nick, drop that nasty beat. I mean, say it like you mean it. DJ Nick, can you drop that nasty beat? Sure can, Andy. The Jenga boys are coming, and everybody's jumping. New York to San Francisco, we are in San Francisco. The Jenga boys are Dude. coming, and Dude. everybody's Dude. jumping. New Dude. York to San Francisco, to we Dude. are in San Francisco. Perfect. Okay, let's okay. play the game. Good job, Dudes, Mike. Dudes, that job, rocks. Everyone. Thank you. Thanks, Thank Big you. Mike. Thanks, dude. I'm going to clear off all this Christmas gack real quick. Yesterday, um, Nick said, oh my god, dude. We call we call Mike the dude, but D-E-W-D. I was like, what the fuck did you think I was thinking? Why did... Yes, obviously. <laughs> and he was like, that's a great idea. <laughs> Andy, you obviously have to write things down for me. <laughs> if I don't see it spelled, I don't sure. understand it. Sure, okay, here we go. How, you, how would I spell dude, Mike? How do you think I would spell dude? Double O. Dude. Double O, right? Yeah, I would spell it D-double-O-D. So when yeah. you said he's the dude, I was like, oh, he's the dude. But then it occurred to me there's a better way to do it. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta do it. <laughs> All I right, mean, it didn't occur to you, but okay. Here we go. Should we Rochambeau to see who goes first? Yeah, sure thing. Go first. Okay. Here we go. Piece number one. How about that? Got piece number one right there. And that's it. Okay. We'll uh, return to this in 2026. Yeah, some, sometime around whenever whenever Jeff Bezos gets off his duff and buys okay. a mixer. And we can get those past episodes back. It's really when, a shame. When the new Elder Scrolls comes out, we'll, we'll get back to it. That sounds good. Yeah. I like that idea. Cool. Sounds okay, good. Great. Ladies and gentlemen, now it's time for your Photoshop challenge. Of course, we issued the challenge out on Twitter. We said, guys, it's been three years since you've seen us. Photoshop challenge, theme of this week is anything from popular television or movies or streaming services from the last three years. I don't want to interrupt you. Can you hit me with a nasty beat one more time, DJ? The Jenga boys are coming, and everybody's jumping. New York to San Francisco, we are in San Francisco. The Jenga boys are coming, and everybody's jumping. New York to San Francisco, we are in San Francisco. Hey now, hey now. All right, cool. 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 Now we can move on to the Photoshop challenge, which I'm very excited about, because trust me, we have, I'd say, the most talented community on the internet. The most popular show on the internet has the most talented community on the internet, and I cannot wait to see what they have cooked up. TV and movies, right, for the last three years? TV and movies, popular movies and TV from the last three years. And I'm, I'm less excited than you are. Really? And I don't know why. Hmm. Yeah. They're usually I so good like, to you, though. Yeah, I don't, I don't remember that being the case three years ago. I remember it sort of being the vibe that... They like to pick on me a lot, and not so much you or Mike or anyone else in this office. Really, yeah. I don't. I don't know. I feel like they're usually okay. pretty. I mean, we'll see. Pretty nice and 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 generous um, with you. By the way, Lexi Gunner, I need. You're watching in the live chat right now. We're streaming on Mixer. Lexi Gunner is our only person watching. I need you to remember where this piece was three years, yeah. three, three years ago. So I'll hold it up three to the camera right now. now so you can yeah, see it. this should be piece, I believe, uh, four uh, four B. Yeah, but hold it up. Do it again, Kevin. Give me the close up. Okay, now cut wide. Now give me the close up. <laughs> now cut wide. <laughs> that one got you. That one got you. That one got Okay. Just remember that one for us, Lexi. Okay, remember that one, please, Lexi. Thank you for the five dollar super chat, that's Darren. A, that's a great way to to keep our audience around for three years. It's just to put demands on them that we need from them five years from now. Yeah, I'd say so. So I'll put this out there too. If someone else, unique technique in the chat, I'd like you to remember. This sequence of numbers. 
Seventeen. Twenty-four. Sixty-nine. Sixty-nine. Five. There's two sixty-nines in there, just as yeah. a... Yeah, so everyone knows. He I didn't repeat, repeat it by accident. Yeah. That's important. Yeah. <laughs> All right, everyone. Let's kick it off with the very first Photoshop challenge. That's incredible. Wow. This is from uh, Crazy Peanuts. Wow. Number one. This is great. Can I, yeah, the can I get a good crew. little zoom in on the squad right here, Kevin Coelho? Like, look at this. All of us in our ivory tower. Mm. All of us. Connect four up there in the, in the, in the reflection of the. Wait, no way for if you real. Go, if you scroll up a little, Kev. Right there. Oh, Connect look four. at that. We got Warboat. Oh, wow. So, yeah, because Connect Between 3 and 5 and Warboat, that's. If the original poster, if you don't know, there's an airplane in the back. Nobody knew, everybody just thought it was a reflection of an airplane. Very, very important for the rest of the show. Mike, did you watch Succession? Did, he, did they die on an airplane? No. Shut up. Shut the fuck up, dude. Well, that's what everyone would think. Everyone dies on an airplane. Oh. I haven't watched it yet, dude. <laughs> Sorry, dude. That was totally uncalled for and unprofessional. You Thanks, look bro. so good over there. Mike, um, I wish I had a basement that you could just live in. <laughs> I truly do. I really do. 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 <laughs> this is a good right. one. I like this a lot. Let's uh, go to number two. I, I, don't, I think I am... Um, I think I'm... Um, it's good. I mean, Barrett's head looks like it's sort of squeezing through a hole there. And, I, th I uh, think Barrett's Tom Wamsgand. And I believe that Kevin is Cousin Greg. And I am... You see the milk money in the back? Yeah, I didn't Nick, see it before. Is it Nick Tom? But I see it there. Uh, and I see it, and I just... I've gone... I just say, you, you see it, and you let it go. You see the milk mommy? You let it go. You just you move release on. it back out. You just the move world. on from it. Maybe I'm maybe I'm Roman. I forget who I am. But fantastic job. Great job. Great job. Thank you so Great much. Job. Let's see uh, submission number two. Number two. This comes from Aaron Rossinson Thunder. What is your face? It looks so perfect. <laughs> oh, I that's... mean, you are who you've always wanted to be. You've always wanted to be Keaton. I'm Batman. You've always wanted to be that Batman. Wow. I would, you know, I love that it's the fastest man alive in, in America. America. I mean, that you haven't Great tested joke. it in London. You have not tested it overseas. Well, that, that's where we did it first, actually. We haven't tested it. Tested it in London. We didn't do the official stopwatch oh, test. Oh, stopwatch. I see, London, I see. So, it's so, like, initially, I look at this and I go, man, I'd rather not be... Um, you know, Ezra Miller, I'd never rather not be involved. But I like the idea that it's the fastest man alive in America. Great joke. Great joke. Milk Mommy, of course, showing up as Sasha Kaye, as Supergirl. It's a great job. My head, massive. Yeah, massive cranium. Like, huge. Which massive is to scale. Cranium. You know, like, you that's... Do, well, it's all your hair. I have a big dome. Like, when we went to, um, we went to Benihana, and Mike was there as well, and Mike noticed that I could not fit that little stupid hat around my head. The little Benihana hat. The mm -hmm. Benny hat. Put they, it didn't on my put, head. they didn't put Velcro on the back of that thing for you? No, it's massive, dude. That's my, unfortunate. My freaking dome is crazy. Mike, dude, I was had a Hanna. giant dome, dude. Yeah. <laughs> I had a d giant dome. Dude, did anyone at Benny Hanna make fun of Andy's massive cranium? No, but a bunch of cute chicks showed up, and I told them to take the hat off immediately so we could <laughs> talk to them. <laughs> By the way, these cute chicks all likely were with their spouses. <laughs> And they all walk in and Mike goes, bro, bunch of cute chicks, take the fucking head off. We look over, it's three moms with all their kids. I mean, look, man, you gotta practice, you gotta dress for the job you want. Uh, this is very fantastic. Thank you for this. I will say, again, two for two with the milk mommy face. Just Great accept job. it and push it out. Accept it. There Live it is. With it. Let's go to number three, Chris Barnes. This is from Chris Barnes. Uh, cocaine okay. bear, cocaine zero. That's pretty incredible. That's great. It's Man, coke zero. My... It's not actual cocaine, you know? No, that's true. This you got is my, awesome. Uh, you got my pandemic beard in there, too. Yeah. Which is great. Inspired by true events. That was a wild era. Like, looking back at old photos that I would take of you for thumbnails. Yeah. Your beard was down to here. Your it. hair. You were the most psychopathic you've ever looked in your life, and that's saying something. I was skinnier back then. Look at my pecs. They look good. You think that gym guy would have called you big big guy if no, he saw you would, back then? He would have said he would have seen me and said, "Oh my God, is that Jason Statham with a beard?" <laughs> I doubt it. <laughs> Jason Statham's never had that hair before. You think he would have said Jason Statham has more hair now? He has a beard and he's shorter and fatter. 
<laughs> Let's move on to the next one. This All is right. good. I like this. Number four Give yourself Marco. a CZ February 24th. Very, four very good. Four for Marco. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, I hate it. No. Why is it skin color? We're flesh colored turtles. Oh, no. Oh, no. God. Barrett, why did you pick hey, this look one? At, look at Snowbike Mike so pink on the top right. Kevin, oh, my God. Kevin's face mushed down into Raph's like, uh, face mask is just... Tim Tim is Leo, perfect. Um, and then just for no reason, Donna... Oh, it's, it's a blessing. <laughs> no, who is that? Who's... Uh, is, is, is that the milk mommy eyes? Is that the mommy eyes? I can't tell. So we're doubling... Up. Man, Mike looks... <laughs> Wait, is that Cool Greg or Mike? That's Mike. That's Mike. That is. Dudes, I like this one. That is freaking terrifying. That is blessing. That is blessing. That is yeah, blessing. I was say. Blessing is such a Donnie. He is a fucking Donnie. He's a fucking Donnie. Don't tell him I said it, but he's a. If I ever fucking saw a Don tell I see it's blessing. He's a Donnie he's as he's, hell. He's, he's blessing, or I'm not Italian. Kind of you know mutant I mean? ninja humans, mutant mayhem. This is. Horrifying. I'll be thinking about this a lot tonight. That's very, gonna very... Ha- that's, you know what it reminds me of? Uh, uh, the thumb with the face on it. Who, what was that YouTuber that did that? Remember that? Maybe the orange with the face on it? Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> Might be that. That's... <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> Yesterday we had a great moment. We were just reminiscing over KFAF memories and we looked at... Uh... <laughs> Nick was like... Man, I was just like watching some old stuff. Like that 40k club and 48k club skit was so good. Like that, that like it, it's just like it's funny stuff. And I was like, yeah, it was great. He's like, we we printed out two separate shirts. Like we went all out. I was like, yeah, we didn't sell those shirts, there, right? He went, no, nope, of course not. Nope. <laughs> Why would we sell shirts? Why would we try to capitalize off of the popularity of something? I woke up. <laughs> I woke up last night in a panic. Being like, why don't we have a KFAF shirt on the store right now? Yeah. Yeah. We're and then stupid. I thought, we're stupid. Like, we don't. It's just funnier if we don't. <laughs> you know, like, who needs the stability? Fact that, the fact that the standby screen was, uh, thanks for watching whatever came before this. <laughs> Coming up next is KFAF. <laughs> oh. It's perfect. All right, let's move right along. Thank you, Marco, for that. Number five is Mark Scholl. Has given us kind of Andy. Oh, Andor. Oh, wow. It's Andor, but Ooh, I like it, that logo. Wow, yeah, that's good. The rebellion begins. Look at Greg. Look at me as Diego Luna. Oh, my God. You look great with that hair. Look at Greg. Where, is, zoom in to where look are at, the Jedi at? Okay, we, look at Greg right there. Oh, my there. God. <laughs> oh, Gr- Greg is Mon Mothma. <laughs> oh, my God. It's Mon Gregma. That's so scary. Who is Tim? Tim is great. Look at that dumb face. <laughs> <laughs> this is fantastic. This is oh, we great. have Blessing as um, Save the Rebellion, Save the Trees. Mm-hmm. I'm not sure who Barrett is. I don't know who Raj is. I didn't is. watch Andor because... Uh, Why haven't you watched Andor? Because I was too busy watching Star Trek Strange New Worlds. It's the better show. No, it's not. It is. Like, I'm sure it's good, but like... Uh, you're, you're infuriating. You're infuriating. Thank you for that. That was great. I beat Jedi Survivor two days ago. Didn't beat it. I beat the last boss. I, I think I still got to go back to the I thing. keep seeing you pop up, and I'm thinking, like, is somebody at work locking in? But that's you. Me? Great game. That's you, you game. play it. Just came out. Sir, that was it. That's... Kevin likes you didn't earn sip. that. You didn't earn that sip. <laughs> let's, go for, let's go for the next one. Thank All right, next so one comes from David. Oh, this is Zelda's dad, yeah. Oh, Nick Vision. Oh, that's incredible. I look good with long hair. I look good taller than you. This is cool. All Dude, the different shows. That's really suits, cool. Is, of course, Suits makes an appearance. God damn it. But look at me. It's my, it, in the top TV, it's my BSR uh, band. And office. in mine, it's my Windbreaker. Yeah, that's really cool. This, this is, is really cool. Really creative. All right, this is my number out. one so far. Wow. I like that. Yeah, I like this a lot. Uh, this of course, is very, is that very Tommy good. Boy? Look, they, they're all winners to me, okay? No, I pick a winner. That's how we do this. Is so that I'm, the heat? Uh, on the left? No, that's suits on the left. That's when Rachel and Donna. Were oh, hanging out. okay. Of course, you know the exact scene. Yeah, yeah. Like that's one on. of the many times they just used that set right in front of um, Jessica Pearson's office. Turns out you watch a lot of suits. They only had four sets. Can we uh, get the shot on Mike real quick? Like the the wide shot. Um, there was a. A moment yesterday 
where Nick walked up to me and said, Andy, how great would it be if on the TV behind Mike, we just played the full movie of The Heat? <laughs> <laughs> just all of it. <laughs> it's just always showing back there. And I, I was like, copyright strikes. I man, was kind of worried, know? but then I, but I was like, no, I think we cut away cut from him. Mike enough. No, but he's going to be on camera a lot later when we rank the dues. I don't it would have worked. I wish we had talked just about it a little bit because I could have, I could have done it easy. It would have been so great. All I need is a little PNG. Thank you for that one, uh, Zelda's data. Thank you for that one, Zelda's data. Very, very Jesse great job. Jesse G coming up uh, at Pink Spider Felix number seven. Let's take a look. Oh, Whoa! Wow, I love this. Holy cool. crap! They drew that. Look at this. Look at your nitro rifle tattoo. Can we yeah. zoom in on this, little Kev? This is beautiful. The bear. Parody, right? The, the parody? This is great. Look at that, man. God, you look good with that sort of existential I mean, I look angst. good with that, like, body type, of course. Why don't you, why don't we work out more? I don't know. That's a good question. Why don't we go right now, after the show? I'm I gotta just, play ball as gay for seven hours. I'm just gonna go home and eat pizza. <laughs> <laughs> this this is amazing. This is freaking great. Look it's, at Tim. It's funny how old Nick just looks because they made his body so small. They put a lot of gray look frail. Yeah, to, you look frail. to be an a-hole. Mike looks awesome. So, like, what are the references here? I haven't watched The Bear. Uh, these are all the characters from The Bear. So, Kevin is Fack. Oh, look at the Kevin on his computer with our setup. That's so cool. Um, yeah, they, we're just a lot of cooks. Uh, Joey, uh, Joey's the sister character that's helping to, or the cousin character that's helping to run it. Just yeah, this, is, this is great. They nailed Blessing. Fantastic job. Very, very good job. Very, very well done. Thank that was that. Jesse, right? That was Jesse. Amazing. G. Thank you, Jesse G. Uh, let's go to number eight. This is from Forrest Kurth. Oh, oh, the Super Jabroni Bros. This is incredible. Oh my God, Bowser with the milk mommy eyes is the first thing I saw. <laughs> That's and the, the milk in, her, in his head. <laughs> that is the first thing that I fucking look at. Greg is Donkey Kong yeah, on the bottom left. That's psychotic. Oh my God, can we zoom in on this? This is there's so much to unpack here. I don't Holy love me. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like that. <laughs> to scale. <laughs> cool Greg as one of the booze is so oh, good. Amazing. This is amazing. Great. Barrett is one of the uh, another toad. That's great. Look at me in the back with my big old nose. This is great. Joey is Peach down there. I got the Nitro Rifle different suit. I'm like a Mario, but I'm holding the gun. Tim is just Crash. I love that. Oh, my God. Can you scroll up a bit more? Because, uh, yeah, Mike is Luigi with that mustache and the Xbox gear on top of the Luigi costume. Phenomenal. And I just really want to get a zoom in on the Milk Mommy because you captured the essence you captured the feeling. You captured the soul in this Just image. The lifelessness <laughs> behind the eyes, but also holding milk, staring into the depths of hell, staring everywhere and nowhere. <laughs> like this is looking at everything while also looking at nothing. This is so so good. This is very well done. This is very great well done. A little touch. I love the blue star as well. That's great. Great with our, job. With our smiley on it. Great job, Forrest. Uh, number nine. I'm going to need all these tweeted at me now. Because I, at first we were like, nobody tweet at us. Mm -hmm. So we don't spoil it, you know? Yeah. But now I want them all. What did we learn earlier? Tweet these at us four years from now. Put it on your clock, all these people. Number nine, Philip J. Woodward. Oh, this wow. is awesome. Wow, this is pretty. Can we scroll in here? I just started watching uh, my adventures. Oh, yeah? Superman. It's really good. You're enjoying oh. it? Yeah, it's really good. Me. Look at, look oh at, my God, that's look me. Look at how beautiful you are I in my so arms. I look so beautiful and tiny and cute. This looks awesome. Oh, the milk mommy looks so the good. Mom, the mom. This is a this very, is really well done. Okay. How much must it piss off Greg that you're Superman? Oh, he's fuming in the next room. <laughs> he's just eating a fucking leg of chicken or something like yeah. that. <laughs> just breathing he said on the calendar, I'm out at 1130. I was like, God forbid you watch good content yeah. ever at the uh, studio. Make your show, talk about... Whatever game got talk delayed. Talk about the FTC or some shit. Yeah, go ahead. This go is ahead. Talk great. about an NFT here. This is a phenomenal job. Very well done, Philip. Uh, next up, are we on number 10? I want to make sure we're on. Oh, here he's here. I fucking stayed for you. Oh, what's up? I stayed for you, Andy. Who said that? 
Who's, I don't. I don't know. Who is, who is, is that our dad? Dad, <laughs> shut up. We're making the show. Dad, Get down! shut up. Out of your mother's basement. Good job. Dad, is the pizza here? Crazy. He's always doing something. That's annoying. Sorry about that, dude. 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 Yeah, no. He was harsh. Yeah, he was harsh my, 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 yeah too, Mike being here is like it's like when you're at your friend's house and your dad, your friend's dad yells at him, and you're just sitting there like, oh, what do I do now? <laughs> I'm so tough. confused. <laughs> Yeah. All right, let's go Excellent. to number 10. I believe this is Matt Ferguson. Oh, oh wow. wow. That's something right there. That is something. Oh, my gosh. Holy this is incredible. Shit. Look at this. Look at all our likenesses Gary captured with the book perfectly. Of Eli. Wow. Janet back there. Look at you, Andy. Look at so Paris. Cool. Harris looks amazing. Wow, this is incredible. Look at you, Nick. You're the fucking guy. <laughs> you gave me a mullet. Cecil. Cecil, man. You're Cecil. He gave me Cecil's badass Dude, mullet. you have the mullet as well. Yeah. And, and, you know, if memory serves correctly, Cecil is all gray. So, you know, Matt Ferguson taking pity on me, giving me actually, like, brown hair instead of making me an old man. Hmm. That's pretty nice of him. Pretty cool. Pretty this cool. Is, this is phenomenal. That's awesome, Matt. This is Well done again. Phenomenal. You brought it. Like, I like the, I like the little funny video, Amazon Prime there. Oh, um, yeah, that's cute as hell. Hashtag KFA of Holiday. This is such this a is great job. Well yeah, all of our likenesses are captured so well. I love the rendering. I love the I love the the, the rim light, the blue on the side, yeah, like kind of hitting the us, the orange on the left of us. And Greg looking so great as Omni-Man. He looks good. Phenomenal job. God, too bad he's upstairs being an a-hole to everyone. Well, who's, who's Mike? Mike's just a, a hero with the red ring of death. Mike. Dude. That's cool. That's pretty great. This is very, very good. Matt, great well job, done, Matt. as always. Well done. Great job. Uh, five more, ladies and gentlemen. We're going into the uh, the back five here. We got number 11 coming from Ian Vogelsong. <laughs> it, just, it, just, it just never gets old. Uh, you know, somebody in the subreddit pointed out that the Milk Mommy is six years old. Believe that already? Milk Mommy's in like first grade. Milk now. Mommy's out there torturing her teachers. Yeah, absolutely. Just this is very, very good. What is this? What is this from, though? I'm gonna assume. What horror movie is this from? Is it Mother? Pearl. 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 I don't know. See, I don't know my. I don't know my indie horror films. There's apparently one going around right now that's like really popular that I talked talk to me. To me. Yeah, I, yeah I, haven't, I haven't seen that one yet either. It's a lot of fun. Come on, Kevin. What You changed on me, bro. No, no, no. It's, it's like TikTok will have you think it's scary. It's, it's not that bad. Okay. This is a great job. This I is love, great. I love the, like, if the, I can compliment the artistry in it. Yeah. The sort of watercolor painted look on the uh, yeah. forehead. It I'm looks, curious how they accomplished that. Yeah. If it's maybe like a, a filter in Photoshop or if they went in and painted over it. That's pretty cool. It looks really cool. That's really well done. Great job. Really well done. Uh, okay. Now, see, I don't like this at all. What's up? I don't like this at all. Numbers 12 through 15 are Ben, please be excited. Oh. Ben, traditionally never good to me. Never been nice to me in the past. So I expect nothing less than just utter evisceration here. Ben, let's bring up number 12. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, my God. <laughs> Fuck. That's... <laughs> Jesus Christ. That is... <laughs> Off-putting, to this say is, the least. This is a Megan uh, reboot that nobody will watch. I will not watch it, and I'll tell you why. Because it's already terrifying. This is already the stuff of nightmares. Jesus Christ. Just something the way about... Uh, the, the way Ben is able to kind of like blend in faces. Yeah, he's so good at texturing. So, so it's terrifying. Very well done. Uh, friendship has evolved. That's so that's, terrifying. Let's see the next great. one. Let's see the next one, number 13, coming from Ben as well. That one's gonna. Okay. <laughs> oh, this is this is a. Uh, um, is it Schwarzenegger, the Schwarzenegger show? thing? Yeah. yeah. The the Schwarzenegger. I forgot what it was called. I love that this is called Foster. <laughs> World's best grandpa. You're POS. Man. Heroes don't retire. They reload. they reload. That's a cool. That's a, pretty bad, that's a cool that's saying. That's a pretty that. badass town. You're going to look cool when you're old, bro. I hope so. I just yeah. thought I should do steroids now. Okay. I think steroids and Ozempic now. Okay. Just get that, that magical combo together. Yeah, the All right. Let's take a look at number 14 from Ben. <laughs> 65 million years old. 
<laughs> you know what? I'll take this one because he gave me Kurt Russell's hair. And that's all that matters. That's all that matters. That's, that is like the greatest compliment you could pay him. Now, that is Adam Driver's hair, but they, they did widen it. Oh, did they widen know? it yeah. a little bit? Okay. It uh, looks like Kurt Russell's. Graded uh, a bit. And then if you scroll down a little bit, Kevin, you can see my little daughter that I'm protecting. <laughs> <laughs> Such a sweet little child. Just a beautiful can, little can, child. Can I zoom in? Uh, I'm trying to see what the rest of the title says. Earth has a prehistoric what? Visitor. Visitor. Oh, God. Okay. Phenomenal. Phenomenal. That's, uh... That cuts me to the core. That's a good one. All I right. got a good laugh out of the dude over here. Dude. <laughs> the, the, the dude. dude. The dude enjoyed that one. <laughs> um, and rounding out our 15 list of Photoshop challenges right now, another Ben, please be excited. Let's, let's look at our final Photoshop challenge entry. <laughs> the 1900s. It's because you're old. <laughs> Ben, I hate you. <laughs> I hate you. This is great. That's that is actually very great. Good very logo very treatment. Yeah, very very meta. That ninety show coming out of yeah, course in the last few absolutely. years. Absolutely. That nineteen hundred show. Man, you were very, wrong very about being worried about the Photoshop and how they would target I always, you. I always it literally kept yeah. me up at night. I'm I like, kind what of are they gonna that do? They target you a bit. What are they gonna do? Great jobs. I See, mean I need hair plugs. You know, if I could give you all a trophy, I would, and I will. But we can't. They're all my winners today. But we can't. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yes, and We have to pick one. <laughs> Dude, which one was your favorite? Dude. A lot of good dudes out there. Yeah, a lot of good ones. Okay. Yeah, that Dude was his just, favorite. Uh, he had no favorite. abstaining from voting. He had no favorite, and he should, as he should. The, the senator from the great state of Colorado has abstained <laughs> from voting. Uh, so I will, I will pick our winner. I'll pick our winner. I'll pick our winner. Can I pick like my top fifteen? You can pick your you can pick your top one. I'll pick my top one. Top two, top two. How's that sound? You want to go through them one more time or just pick them? Do you remember? Um, I want to shout out. We can shout out people. We don't all have to of pick them. them. All right. All of them. We shouted out all of them, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Andy has made it. Because there's mean, I gotta, so many fucking good ones. I got to give it to Matt. I got to give it to Ben. I got to give it to the the Super Mario, the Super Mario one Brothers one. Has, I mean, honestly, that might be my favorite one. The Nick I think, Vision. Who did Super Vision Mario Brothers? Which one is that, Kevin? That's one, two, three, four, five, eight. six, seven, eight. That is Forrest Kurth. Forrest Kurth did a great job. Great job on this one. This might be this. I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna deem you the winner of the 2023 KFAF Holiday Special. Photoshop challenge. Congratulations, ladies and gentlemen. Let, let me uh, have my trophy. It's not like for the favorite Photoshop. It's for the favorite like part of any of the Photoshops. Sure. And it's the Milk Mommy Bowser. The Milk Mommy Bowser is perfect. Yeah, it's one of the best things we've seen on this show. It's, yeah. it's going to haunt my nightmares and inspire me. In addition to all the other amazing fan art, like Philip J. Art. Woodward, Matt Ferguson, thank Everyone you all for Everyone did a great job. Again. God, it's so good. Uh, of course, <laughs> we usually round out our Photoshop <laughs> challenges. Uh, by telling you guys what next week's theme is going Superman to be. Superman was great, yeah. Uh, next week's theme, next year's theme is going to be uh, anything from uh, Phase 3 of James Gunn's DC Universe. Yeah. So we'll see you guys in three years. Yeah, so the next time we do this show, happens. yeah, hopefully, I'd say about like seven or eight years, we'll see what James Gunn is doing in Phase 3, slash Phase 4, because yeah. I know he might have some issues uh, with delays in the future. So that'll be the, that'll be the theme. Perfect. Mm -hmm. So Dr. Manhattan's or whatever. Dr. Manhattan's. Martian Manhunters. Martian Manhunters. That's, that's what, that's what I was looking for. Yeah. I, was looking for I think Dr. Manhattan, uh, technically. That is DC, yeah. DC. Yeah. yeah. I don't know if Watchmen is or not. Ha, ladies and gentlemen, thank you for sticking around with us right now. It's time to rank those dudes. We're oh, wow. We're a full of dudes, and we're gonna rank the dudes. You may think that we're fools. We're not fools. Don't get mad at us, we don't make the rules. We're gonna do what we do, maybe we'll do what we do. It's time to rank the dudes. We're gonna do what we do. Very, very excited for this. I'm this very is, excited for this too. This has been a long time coming. About a decade in the planning. A long time in the making. I have uh, I'm gonna scoop this up like it's a coffin. As you all know a, coffin, a baby coffin. As you all know that, I, you know, I'm on Mountain Dew's mailing list and they often send me 
the rarest and sweetest treats that are really, really tough to find out there in the real world. Um, often special editions, often limited editions, and I've been wrangling them up for the past decade or so. So we could uh, have one big definitive ranking. Mm -hmm. Now, did I, was I scavenging all over the city of San Francisco this morning yeah. to find Mountain Dew Voltage? Because I, 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 that was like the safe bet for me. I was like, those are in the regular lineup. They, they're nowhere to be found except for a place that's pretty close to us. Um, it, was all, it was under my nose the whole time. So we have all the flavors that I wanted. Um, me and Nick will be drinking them. The dude over here will likely be the tiebreaker if we happen to disagree with whatever the do, uh, if we happen to disagree with each other, the dude will abide and the dude will kind of set us straight here. So I feel like very excited. I feel, I feel very excited about that, Andy. I'm, I'm, I'm sure the dude will come through, but let's not forget less than three minutes ago when I asked him to pick his favorite, he did not. You're right. He did. He did say it's a lot of dude. dudes. <laughs> he said a lot of dudes. It's a lot, a lot of, of dudes. As if he's contractually ob obligated to only say dude. Well, know? we didn't give him, I mean, to be fair, any direction. <laughs> You're right. You're right. And then we made him sit through four hours of rehearsals yesterday, during which time he just sat there. Yeah. And did nothing. He did a great job. But he did a great job because Mike is a constant Mike, professional. Mike, you're doing great. You're Ladies and gentlemen, great. we're going to kick off our Dew ranking. Here we go. With this is exciting. The original, the one and only Mountain Dew. This oh. is where it all began. This is where it all began. This, this is, is the is Alpha and the Omega. This is where the, you know, farmers in the mountains were finding this. Oh, look at that uh, color. The cry, yeah, it look is. It's color. neon. There are some of these Mountain Dews that his flavored. I feel like will glow in the dark. Yeah, you know. Now we have we're going to rank twenty of these bad boys today, which means we're going to take twenty shots of Mountain Dew, which means we're going to be drinking the equivalent to eight gallons. Yeah, Cheers. I mean it should be fine. It should be fine. Cannibal number one down Cannibal. the hatch. Down the hatch. Here we go. Just to kind of remind you what it is, and I didn't drink any energy drinks this morning because I knew I was going to have just a buttload of sugar. <laughs> So good. Oh, man. It's so good. It's my number one. So sweet. That's my number one so far right now. Mr. Dude, Dude. if you would please put it on the list. Our ranked dues, original Heck Mountain yeah. Dew, number one. Thank you, dude. Let us know if you want any as well, Mike. But I have a, uh, he's, he's twerking for the camera right now. <laughs> Twerk for us. Twerk for us, Big Daddy. <laughs> I was surprised that Mike didn't move his body. He moved his body for Mike the Dues. But I want to I want to see him move it again. So when we're done with this, we'll run maybe we'll run the graphic one more time and, and have him dance for us. Okay. Or you can just play it for us. Cool. Because I love when Mike dances. You can maybe sit over here with us. Um, no, I like him over there. Oh, okay. Number two, Andy. There's an emergency happening. What? What? There's an emergency happening. The hunt for Red October has gone downtown. Downtown. <laughs> code red. Oh, it's code red. Oh Jesus. Oh oh oh! Holy shit! Warning! Warning! Code red. Advertencia. Advertencia. Terminate <laughs> centavos, por favor. Whoa, this is scary. I didn't know it was affecting the room we're in oh, right now. It's crazy. This it's might like, be my number one just like based Dumanji. off of Kevin nailing that lighting. Is, are these new shot glasses? They are. Man, these are you're such a professional. I'm a consummate professional. Wow. Okay. It's crazy how like the red light is making it just look clear when you're in red light. I know. Here we go. Right, cheers. Code red. Take a little drink. Here you go. Man, oh my God, dude! Right now, so Mike, Mike, I am, I'm. Right now, I'm in stormwind, and I'm going back to level up a new piece of gear. And I'm going to talk to that one NPC, and I'm leveling up my night elf hunter. This is World of Warcraft. This is the best times of my life, and it's been downhill ever since. This is number one for me. Code I'm Red gonna, number one. I'm gonna shock the world right now. I'm gonna say this is my number two. Wow. I don't like cherry fuck flavored things. To hell. I don't like cherry flavored things. Go fucking. And the Mountain Dew, the original Mountain Dew is just dude. so good. It's so good. Dude, what do you think? Dude. That's crazy. I can't believe you said that, bro. That's crazy. This is number one with a bullet. With a bullet, it's bro. Code red. All right, Come I got outvoted. I got outvoted. Number three. Number three. It's time to get blasted. Andy. Time for the Baja Blast. Oh Three, man, you know, and here I think I, I think I may Baja shock Blast. the world with with my Baja Blast take. With your Baja Blastness, because I think okay. I, I don't think I like Baja Blast. I I don't know that I've ever had the Baja Blast, so we're just gonna pour this. 
Oh, I like the color. It's a nice that. color. That, t- that turquoise color is nice. It, it evokes ocean breeze, summer breeze. But here, let me put this. It smells weird. Let me smell it. That's odd. It's like a fruit punch smell. It smells like a. Uh... Hmm. <laughs> Dude, you okay over there? Dude. <laughs> It's, it's fine. It's gonna be tough re-ranking all this shit it's moving them around. Fine. We're gonna be fine. Cheers. Here we go. Oh, you know what? It's hitting right now. That's hitting, dude. I'll tell you what, it's hitting right now. That's hitting. And it never does. And I'm not sure what it is about this environment or the people that I'm amongst. But the only thing that, that ever matters is the people right here in this room. Doesn't matter if you win by a mile or a quarter mile. Or half a mile. <laughs> Joke. Winning's winning. God damn, this is good. I'm gonna, I gotta, I gotta this juxtapose it. This goes to number it. two for me. This goes over. I gotta juxtapose it. Oh, you gotta clean the palette? No, I think Mountain Dew's still my favorite. I would put this at number three. Oh, I dude? like, the original Mountain Dew's just so good. It's lemon limey. Dudes. Pour me up a couple shots right Fuck now. Fuck yeah, I'm gonna brother. Have to judge this. Get in here, brother. This is gonna be so, it, it's, it's shock the world good. I wasn't expecting it, and here you go. Get in there. Great camera work from Barry Courtney. I'd like the original. My apologies, dude. Over this? No, no he like just wants to, he wants to A-B test him. Oh. You gotta A-B test him. We need this too much. We need to do this shot glass. Hmm. He's thinking, he's pondering it. Coming around. I gotta go with the dude. Mountain Dew over Baja Over Baja Blast. Baja Blast. Okay. All right. You're the tiebreaker, dude. Vindicated. You're the arbiter. And vindicated. Drink your juice. You're the arbiter. Drink the rest. There you go. They don't have a spit bucket. You probably should. Fine. You you committed to this. I did. You're right. This was you wanting to do this. Um, I think. What do you think? You want to leave him here just in case we have to A-B test? A yeah, no, keep him here. So that but we can the mirror the, the ranking as well. Okay. Because I feel like this is going to get real hard for Mike to do the rankings. All right. I'll, when we're moving I'll mirror the ranking the right now. I'll try yeah. to mirror it here. Yeah, that'd be great. Uh, we'll have to hold up our stuff to... Uh, Barrett, I'll hold it up to the camera. For also, the I'd like uh, to let Barrett know that we originally bought Mike's suit for Barrett with the plan that Barrett would never get on camera <laughs> that he was just going to be wearing. We bought... <laughs> yeah. Just sweating with us. <laughs> For no we were reason. Like, <laughs> yeah, we'll get Barry a little suit too. And then Nick was like, what if he never came on camera? We just made him the suit. <laughs> it killed me. It killed me. <laughs> <laughs> but now Mike's having to wear this because the Big Mountain Dew, if you all saw social media, the big bottle suit. Too noisy. It's so loud. Material that a lot of noise. <laughs> makes a lot too of loud. noise. I like Mike in a nice soft cotton sweater. I like this. Which is All this? Right. This is Passion Fruit Punch. Oh, this is Passion one of the newer oh, sorry, ones. I'll this up for you, Bear. There you go. This Passion is one of the newer ones. I got to remember how to do this. Passion Fruit Punch. Wow. It smells. Man. It smells. I'll tell you what, man. These Mountain Dew fucking freaks over there, they just know what the right combinations of flavors are. Oh, oh. Oh, you don't like it? I oh, like it. Ah. Uh. Four. I don't like it. Oh wow! I would put this. This passion fruit is kind of kind of grapefruity. It's gross. Gross. Number four. Okay, I agree with you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna push over. Yeah, I yeah, like yeah. it. All four of these so far, I enjoy. Thoroughly I'm s- enjoy. I'm starting to get that feeling like that one time you made me drink that energy drink and my hands started hurting. <laughs> is that weird? When Greg was talking to Chris Anka on the podcast. And Nick off camera is looking down and just goes, <laughs> just starts looking at his hands. I felt so weird. <laughs> I felt funky. Ooh, what's up next? All right, ne- up next, we've got Caribbean Splash. Ooh. Oh, you go Caribbean. I go Caribbean. Caribbean. Mountain Dew. I love, now I'll tell what's you what. A, what's the over love under? the can design on this. Bear, what do you go, Caribbean or Caribbean? Caribbean. Mike? Caribbean. That's a that's that's oh, that wasn't an option. You made that up option. right now. You just made that up. That's Mike just saying words. <laughs> okay, cool. I thought he'd break the tie and he just added more chaos. 
Oh, Ooh. look at the color on this. Oh, that's pretty. See, when I see this can, I don't know why I think that it's Christmas themed, but it's most certainly not. Oh, it's pink. Yeah. It's pinkish. Oh, the pink is so, like, you show me a pink drink. If you pour this next to Baja Blast, that's a nice color combo right there. That's a nitro rifle color. Oh, combo. I like that. Here we go. All right. Caribbean Bottoms splash. up, Caribbean splash. Splash in a room. Get me go like this. Ooh. Now, what's this? Artificial guava. Oh, God. This is That's delicious. I would put this over passion fruit punch. You don't like no. a guava? Oh, it's too artificial tasting. If they use real guava, if they had the balls <laughs> to use up. real fucking guava, <laughs> Shut the then fuck maybe up. it would be a different story. Why is this a stance you have suddenly? <laughs> but the good people over at the terrible Pepsi Co. If they use don't real have the, guava. Oh, let me look at the ingredients right now. Does it say, no, just as artificial flavor. That's all it says. This is delicious. This is gross. Can guava. I love this. This is delicious. I would put this over passion fruit punch. Mike, you're going to have to come in here. You're going to have to give us a tie yeah, break. This is so good. Let me taste this. This one's delicious. There you go. That's this. Then I'll pour you a little bit of this. Take a little sip -ski. Take a little sip I like having you right here, there. Mike, because you're always on my side. And you, you don't forget that I schedule the payroll to pay your bills. This is good, right? You just gave me the eyes like you're <laughs> you with that. massively flirting with me. <laughs> like, he, like he's one of those ladies from last night. <laughs> Take that dumb hat off, Andy. Take that There's dumb hat off. Here. <laughs> we got some baddies here. Yeah, they're all with their husbands. <laughs> I'll tell you this right now while Mike's doing that. Mm. Don't love that the, uh, the holes, the drinking holes, don't line up perfectly with the logo. I've always, I've always. I just feel like that. that's just. I mean, come on, Pepsi. Like, look at Coke. Look at how perfect Coke is. No, See how that, that works? It's not always it's terrible. <laughs> that is not even, not it doesn't even, work at all. Not even close. Okay. Not even well, close. you take your shots, you miss your shots. Mike, what's the final verdict? Where's it going? The guava will go above the passion fruit. God damn it. Great you know call. Can I get someone here that believes everything that I believe? Great call, Mike. It should be a fucking thing that happens once Great in a while. Great call, Mike. I'm just going to this real quick. I'll grab this real quick. Next up, we have Summer Freeze. Oh, Summer Freeze. That's one of the... Um, now, this shit looks like uh, coolant. That that's like a... current yeah, anti-freeze. That's a current, um, like, uh, seasonal one right now. That's the... Uh, I believe it's Bomb Pop flavored. Tell you what, nothing, nothing makes more sense than Summer Freeze. Summer Freeze! Makes me feel fine. Na, 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 na. Jesus. Got a little cotton mouth there. <laughs> you know, it wasn't right. Sugar is kind of. Oh my God. Sugar is coagulating in the roof of my mouth. This is not a good call. I'll tell you what, I'm getting hyper. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, me too. I'm getting something. Look at the color oh of this. Oh my gosh. You need to pour less. <laughs> don't worry. Don't you worry about it. That's a good idea. This That's is, a great idea what you just said. This I is, like it because you can feel it in your veins. Yeah. <laughs> like you can feel something. You can feel your veins struggling. Oh. <laughs> Let me tell you one thing right now. This tastes like a blue otter pop, and I love it. This is going high for me. Oh, man. Get the fuck out of here. This is so good. It's so good. This is number two for me. This might be number two for me. This also. is number two for me. Get the fuck out of here, Mike. You don't get a vote anymore. <laughs> Put it up. I mean, I want to taste the best yeah. one. If it's like that, I want to taste it. Yeah. <laughs> you want to just, you just come sit on the you couch You just want to pour it in your mouth? Just come sit on the couch with this. Here you go. Damn, dude, that's good. That's, <laughs> that's good. good. Damn, dude, that's good. This this rocked my world right now. I would put it. I would put it at number three. But since you want, you guys want it a little higher, we'll put it at number two. How's that sound? I I think it goes at number two. And also, I think you wanting it underneath the OG is just your whole like Iron Man is the best movie and Fast and Furious One is the best Fast and Furious movie. You do this thing. Are you having sort of like an intervention with me right now? Because <laughs> I feel like you just like whatever thing happened last. <laughs> well <Okay>. said. <laughs> now we are the, the comments on all of our YouTube sessions. <laughs> Nick just likes whatever he just saw because he's stupid and doesn't remember anything. Here we it's go. True. Frostbite. Frostbite. Oh, Frostbite. Sorry. Next up. Frostbite.
There's a shark on it, so that's why I'm... I don't know that, how evident that was that there's a shark on well, the logo. Well, I was turning it upside down. I think oh, I was covering okay. the shark, but it's fine. This is a nice little, like, summer vibe theme right here. Okay. To go with Christmas similar, in July and August. Similar blue color. There we go. Yeah, I like, I like how you've arranged these. We're in summertime right now. That's yeah. kind of fun. I try to kind of, like, make it themed, you know? Here we go. <laughs> what are you whispering? I don't know. I don't know either. At first I was like, oh, it's a wannabe summer freeze. But then it kind of tastes like it's the, got bleach in can it. Can you maybe read the can for me? Is Not there any frostbite? Are there any like, hey, this is a naturally and artificially flavored dew. There's but there's no like there's usually a hey, this is blueberry fucking whatever energy or whatever. I don't know. I don't I hold on. Now that I've had some time away. Let me reintroduce myself to the frostbite. I don't know. Oh, this that's is, a frostbite. It's like... I just don't. I it's don't. not gross. It's I not just, gross, but it's not... I, I put it's it not differentiating I'm put it last itself. Because at least it's, it's boring. You know? I agree. Yeah, try the frostbite, Mike. Try the frostbite. It's like... It's, you, it has think, nothing dude? to say. Dude, what do you think? It has nothing to say. It's just a basic do. Yeah, it's just a it, basic. It's got nothing, you know, it has nothing unique to say about anything. I think we put it dead last. I, I'm with it. I'm uh, with I it. I just feel like it's dead last. I just feel like if you're not going to. No, if this is the only drink that I had, I would drink it and I'd enjoy it. But it's like, I, I don't know. I wouldn't think anything of it, but I didn't like this purple one because mm -hmm. I thought it was disgusting and an abomination and should be purified with fire. But at least it had personality. You're fine with fire, okay. Yeah, take it out to the fucking back and light it on fire and listen to it squeal as it dies. Jesus fucking Christ. Wow. All right, well, it's that's dark, dude. That's, that's the first, uh, that's the first leg of, of these dudes. Why don't we take a break, Nick? Let's take a break and let's get a message from our sponsors. What better way to celebrate the annual, one time only, KFAF unsponsored holiday special event for Christmas in July and August, brought to you by Mountain Dew, and by buying an album unavailable for purchase. Featuring all of your favorite Christmas in July and August, not sponsored by Mountain Dew songs. I wanna wish you would do with Christmas. I wanna wish you would do with Christmas. I wanna wish you would do with Christmas from the bottom of my heart. Feliz Navidad. Feliz Navidad. Feliz Navidad. Prospero. Caress your lover as you listen to the sultry sounds of Atomic Blue Christmas. I'll be so blue just thinking about do decorations of code red on a green Christmas tree atomic blue Christmas without you Thank you, thank you very much. Rock and roll with Mountain Dew Rocks. Mountain Dew, Mountain Dew, Mountain Dew rocks. Berry monsoon or Halloween's voodoo. Cold red or voltage or maybe pitch black. Let's drink some Baja Blast. Live wire, flaming ox fire. Let's drink the night away. Mountain Dew time is the best time. To go gaming with your friends today. Mountain Dew, Mountain Dew, Mountain Dew. Find out what old Saint Nick is up to. Up on his high horse, he's a dick. We do not like that old fuck Nick. He's super short and really gross. It's a fact we hate him the most. Or perhaps you're not really into the classics. And you'd rather get down with something more modern. Say a song that came out around 20 years ago? This is the song that will likely get this video demonetized and taken off of YouTube. I 
The official album for the annual one-time only KFAF unsponsored holiday special event for Christmas in July and August is unavailable everywhere. Brought to you by Mountain Dew. Wow. Really, really looking forward to seeing how many we sell on that one that's not available. Again, another missed opportunity. One song in there yeah. I don't recall writing with you. Or it being in the rehearsals? Which one? St. Nick being a dick? I don't... Oh, yeah, I don't know. Yeah, that one just kind of like snuck up in there. We had some last minute... Um, okay. Some last minute work was done, so Couple, yeah. Okay. I, maybe it was omitted from the rehearsals on purpose to kind of surprise you. That was great. <laughs> that was great. Um, yeah, I mean, the Spotify streams on that album are just through the roof right now. It, it's funny, because I just... Who's that? I'm sorry. Hello? Hello? Taylor? You want us to come open for your next concert in Johannesburg? We're unavailable. Man, that's a power move. That's a real power I'll move. I'll wait right for there. the offer to be better. It's not good yet. It's a good call. She offered us twenty million dollars. <laughs> but it's not enough. I have scruples. It's not enough. I don't just come to her back and call. I'm not. I'm not Tom Hiddleston. What am I? Tom Hiddleston? Did they date at any point? They did. Remember, he wore the I Love Taylor Swift shirt, and it was super tight, and everyone made fun of him for being, like... Was that, like, 10 years ago or something? What decade are we supposed to be? <laughs> <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, let's keep this going. Next up on our list, Mountain Dew. Hot, hot, hot. Flaming hot. hot. Flaming hot. Flaming hot. Hot, 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 hot. Flaming hot. Did you, do you need that to be longer by any chance? No, I think that was good. Okay. I, just, I don't know if we're going to do a close-up of the can. Oh, okay. Perfect. Okay. Now, I can't wait to see the color on this. Flaming hot. Flaming hot. Oh, my God. Just in case you wanted that. That is a god-awful color orange. Oh, my goodness. What did they do to achieve this? This is going to be... This dude, is one of those things where, like... Our poo is going to be so weird. You know where... Uh, when you try to print a shirt and they're like, no, we can't print that color on this shirt. Like, this is like, yeah. we can't make that color liquid in real life. That color doesn't life. naturally occur doesn't in nature. Ex- it doesn't exist in real life. Hold on. Ooh. Oh. Oh. It's got kick to it. You have your flaming Hot down there if you want to try it out. Try it out, dude. This is interesting because here's the thing. Ugh. I didn't have access to the one... It's got a spice. It's got a kick to it. It's got I guess flaming hot makes sense. Makes but, sense. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but th- they also came out with one that had a um, a citrusy vibe, where it was like flaming hot with lime. Yeah. This is just the standard one that they sent me. So this me. is just orange soda with cayenne pepper mixed in. But again, I'm gonna go out on a limb and say at least it has personality. Unlike this. You're right. Piece of shit, garbage, frostbite, horse shit. Okay. Dick knocking. Maybe that's enough. Mother loving. Mike should have hit Loves on one of those mother? mothers from Benihana. <laughs> Piece of shit frostbite drinks. Okay, that's not bad. It's I'm pretty gonna, good, I'm going to sandwich this in. This is my vote right here. Right here. I, I like that. That's a good call. It's got a Man, battery. Man, this has got like, a, there's cool. a spice to it. It feels like I'm drinking like a salsa or something. If it had vodka in it, though, I wouldn't be pissed. At it. Like a tequila in it, I wouldn't be pissed at it. Though. You Ooh. thought it would have been like a cinnamon, like fireball type Me too. situation. And it's not. That's it is what, like, it is a heat that hurts the back of my throat. What, what I was... What I was led to believe is that it was supposed to be a cinnamon type drink. So I'm very confused by that. Well, you know, maybe, it should, it's go, maybe it's been, it should go last because they misled you. I was going to say maybe because it's been sitting in my room for about three years. So you think that <laughs> you think that the potency of it wore off a little bit of the cinnamon? I think maybe it sat next to the cans of chili in my room for a bit too long. Mm. Kind of ex- long exposure, you know. Did we at any point look into how long a counter Mountain Dew lasts and is, and is safe? To be they consumed? don't expire. I looked into it. 
I asked the best scientist. I asked the best scientists all around the world. The best scientists are out there. President Trump. And I asked, uh, <laughs> I asked him, does Mountain Dew ever, ever, ever expire? And they said, no, the Mountain Dew never expires. Never expires. Oh. Did, you ask, did you ask Kamala Harris? Kamala, I asked her about the Mountain Dew as well. <laughs> Let's move on. Okay. You start. <laughs> Sir, uh, your honor. China. The prosecution opened the door for this. <laughs> Next up, we're going to go to Thrashed Apple. Thrashed Apple. There this this right. was a weird one that I didn't know existed, and I had to look it up, and I had to... I believe I found it at some like weird website that may or may not be officially licensed. Nope. I did the wrong thing here. Hold on. This is wrong. Supposed to be uproar. Oh, uproar is my, next. My apologies. It's supposed to be uproar. It's okay. We can put Thrash Apple to the side. Put Thrash Apple uproar to the side. Uproar was another one that I had to buy from one of those websites from Amazon, and it came in like a special. It was like Saran wrapped. Ooh, I think by good. a dude named like Bill in Kentucky or something. Now this has kiwi in it. This is this is a charge with berry, kiwi. berry kiwi. Now I'll tell you what. I love this color. This color rocks. It's it's a it's this color a, is, the, is is the bomb. It's a nice coral sort of color. I knew it. I, I didn't like say it. knew he was. Good. I didn't say it. <laughs> Did not say it. He didn't say it. I'm mean, I'm kind of worried about this one because by the way you opened it, zero carbonation. Not a lot of carbonation. <laughs> like this, this. It is. It is flat as can be. There's a good it chance that this soda Utah. is. Ju I'm just like drinking a, a Powerade right now. This mm -hmm. is basically like a Gatorade. Bottoms up. Now I'll tell you what, if that had bubbles in it, if that had any sort of carbonation in it, if that wasn't like if Pick like, it up uh, a little bit. <laughs> that's good. This is good. That's good. This is good. But if it had bubbles, it might be great. So I might get in here. Mike, can you come blow on this? I'm coming to get it. Man, this is really good. You wanna take a rip right off the toot? The two liter? Can I rip the toot? Rip the toot. No, just give him some of that, because I may take it home. <laughs> yeah, you should take it home. Here you go. This is a good one. I like this. That's pretty good, man. I think this goes, I would say this goes underneath the original Mountain Dew for me. That is very good, dudes. That's a really good kind of vibe, right? Again, it's, you'd go underneath the OG. Now, that means Mike has to move a lot of stuff on the That's board. <laughs> Number four for me over Baja Blast. Okay. I love I, it. I'd go with it, too. I'm cool with that. No, I like well, it. You got outvoted. Oh, so. okay. <laughs> Unfortunately, you don't get a vote anymore. Oh, okay. You brought Mike in. Mike has superseded you. He's my new best friend. Okay. He's the new co-host of the show. Remember that, Lexi Gunner. Remember that Mike's the new co-host of the show for three years from now. I love you, dude. I love you back, dude. Somebody help me. Flaming hot. Flaming hot. Picture me at 1 p.m. No, I'd say like around like 9.30 a.m. Recording that in my bedroom. I had the window open as well, just to let some breeze in. I just sense. go, flaming hot! <clears throat> ah, fucking shit. And I'm just having a restart. Oh, yeah. I, uh, <laughs> I, got, I have new neighbors that moved in upstairs. And for the last week, they've just been moving furniture around at odd hours. And at, I think at like 11 o'clock at night a couple days ago, it got quiet finally. And you just hear this coming out of my room. All I want for Christmas <laughs> is to... And I just feel like, stop, shut the fuck up. And I was great. like, fuck you, fuck you. <laughs> it was great. <laughs> Burn it all down. All right, Thrashed Apple. Thrashed Apple. Thrashed Apple. This is an ugly color. But oh, I kind of like these two colors together. But it smells good. See these two colors right here? Oh, that's a good, like, color Look combo. color combo. Light lime and have you heard? Her, have you heard how people, uh, Mike has heard about this for sure, the dude, has heard about people obsessing with jersey color combinations on the field. Dang, dude. It tastes like pine salt. That tastes oh, like man. pine salt. I love this because I love apple. <laughs> <laughs> this is it. This is my head. <laughs> oh, wow. This is... I don't like this at all. I love this. Dude, get I, in here. I love, Try this. I love sour apple. I don't like it. I don't like it. I've gotten thrashed off some apple before. This, this yeah. might be worse for me than frostbite. That's crazy that you would say such a thing. That's good. That's good, that, brother. That is a melted that, down apple jolly rancher yeah, right there. Absolutely. Yup. Yep. It's why I loved Carl Jacobs' apple gummies. When he sent us those gummies, by the way, send some more, Carl. 
Carl, if you're watching. Roger didn't like him, man. I was like, Roger, you're crazy. They're fucking delicious. Anyway. Roger was, also yeah, Roger was like, well, I froze them. And I was like, why would you freeze them? And he was like, well, that, isn't that how you eat gummies? He's like, I've never, I'm not trying to why judge you. Why would you make them harder on your <laughs> I was like, I'm not trying to judge you, but I've never heard anybody freeze uh, gummies or anything no. like that. Yeah, I was very, very confused by that uh, right there. Oh, Jesus. Wait, we haven't ranked Thrash Apple yet. <laughs> <Should I get? laughs> we'll just put it dead last. There we sure. go. It's dead last. Go. What's sure. next? Thunder, purple thunder. Oh! Oh, Jesus. The seasons are changing, Andy. Is it not summertime anymore? Are we now moving into autumn? It's purple thunder time. It's almost as if the game is dictating the world around us. Whoa, that's pretty crazy. Do you think dad's upstairs messing with the lights? Daddy Greg? I hope not. I in this narrative, not. in this shared narrative, do you think Daddy Greg is married to the milk mommy? Purple no. Thunder. Purple no, no, thunder. no. Now, um... Jesus, it's still thundering around here. It's <laughs> really getting rainy it's outside. It's pouring. It's pouring outside. You know, we're in the Bay Area. Um... I will say that um, no carbonation in this either. I cannot vote for this Why? because I was sponsored by Purple Thunder. Oh, you're well. Just put hashtag. So I'll, I have, I'll have Mike uh, sponsor for me because I, I have ethics. All right, dude, get over here. Let's come check this out. Yeah, come. Uh, here, you, you take that. Pour, why don't you pour me one as well? Just take a little swig ski. And it's really coming down out there. Wow. How do you like that? I'm not mad at it. I'm not mad at it, dude. It just doesn't do much good. for me. It, yeah. Again, it needs carbonation. A lot of these mm. are flat because they've been sitting underneath your cans of chili for four years. Who said? How do you know? I can tell. Mm. The mm. ones that taste mm. like feet, those are the ones. Mm. I'm going to put this right above. I put this right above the green apple, but we got we to gotta rank the green apple. The thrashed apple. I love the thrashed apple. Thrash thrashed apple is very good. So let's put this dead last. No, I think we should, here's what I think we should do. Okay, talk to me. Because Thrashed Apple at least wants to be someone. I think we put Thrashed Apple above the Flamin' Hot. Interesting. Here, right? Because you guys loved it so much. Okay. Get off the can. And then we put this right here. Suck in the wow. Thrashed Apple's gooch, and that's going to be the list right there. Okay, dudes. I'm going to go with whatever y'all want. Wait, wait what, what were you now, thinking? Now, let me tell you what. How, this is how the dude would Man, it's still coming out. do okay. this. That's crazy. I would put Thrashed Apple fourth, right behind Baja Blast, Whoa. and I would put this Purple Tropic above the Cayenne Pepper. We already voted for the Purple Tropic. Fine. I All like out. that. I'm, I'm I just like Mike's vote. That's what I would. I like Mike's vote. Where did this purple one go? Right, right here. above the Cayenne. The Purple Thunder okay. above the Flaming Hot. Okay. All right. Looks like the rain's subsiding a little bit. Uh, like no, 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 it's still going. No, it's okay. still going. <laughs> it's still going. I guess we'll, do, we'll go over to Sweet Lightning next, and this this is an interesting bottle. Yeah. Because this came in an Armored Core Six Fires of Rubicon um, canister. Yeah. The um, so Sweet Lightning's only available at KFC. Okay. So I had to go to KFC to get it. Um, so this is like brand new. This is a new soda from Fountain. Yeah. Oh, this is gonna be good. So I this took it out. Lit. So I poured it into a cup, right? And then I put it into that when I got home. Oh, shh. Oh, you hear that pop? Yeah, it, yeah. it's. Oh, it's it's got it's some popping. carbonation Here to it. Here we go. Oh, fuck. Yeah. Remember, this, Sweet Lightning Ring This smells very, like a Hello Kitty. I just wanted to eat that. And it looks like the most fluorescent thing you've ever seen in your life. This was, uh, this ranked. Oh, my God. This ranked very high for us last time. Sweet Lightning is the KFC uh, exclusive flavor, and it is a peach. Sort of it looks like vibe. Dayquil. Got a little peach vibe. Cheers. Here we go. Sweet lighting, kind of on theme with the thunder outside. <laughs> Crazy how that worked out. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> whoa. <laughs> whoa. 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 Uh. <laughs> <laughs> We're so sh <laughs> This is good. We're so high this is shit. this is good. This is gonna go. Oh. This might be my new number three. Cool. I, I, I actually might. This might be go higher for me. You put this over the bomb pop. This is number three for me, below the bomb pop. <laughs> <laughs> Heart racing, mind beating. Am I speaking out loud? Am I talking to myself? I don't know anymore. No, go number three. This is really fucking good though. If this had ice in it and a little bit more carbonation. Number one with a goddamn bullet. This might be the only thing I need to take a little more of. I'm talking real fast, real fast. <laughs> you wanna try some of this big dog? Yeah, try, try some. Yeah. 
Try some of the sweet lightning, Mike. This is good, dude. So, oh, the, oh, the rain, oh, there it is. So good. Rain, rain came back. Maybe I didn't make the file long enough. Sound of thunder. There you go. Try that big dog. You're, you're sucking off my lips too. This I thing goes peaches, 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 peaches. I put that at number three. All right. Underneath the bomb pop. Above the original Mountain Dew. Let's Above the OG. Let's do it to it. Got it. I like that. Mike's like, fuck, I gotta move a bunch of shit. <laughs> Mike knew what he was getting himself into. Oh, I got my little Santa hat though. All right, Andy. I'm, I'm kind of scared because so far, a lot of these seasonal <laughs> ones have had an, an, an adverse effect on our studio. So I'm really hoping the next one, Spark, doesn't do anything bad. No, it shouldn't be fine because I. Uh -oh. oh, shit. We oh, might no. be having a, some sort oh, of shortage. No, we're having here. some sort of electrical problem just like PG&E fucked us last week. Oh, no. Oh, oh, my God. Son of a gun. We've lost power again. Luckily, we have the Christmas lights on power back up. We do. We have those on the generator. Yeah. Why, those, is there, why is there light coming in from those, the window down here? What do you mean? Down, we're on the third floor, actually. We're not in the, You thought we were in a basement? No, we're on the third floor. Yeah, there's still, there's, we still have some like light seeping in. Huh? Can you can you can you bust out your phone just so I could like maybe use your phone flashlight sure. or something just yeah, to kind of light the drink? Yeah, absolutely. Or or maybe we just have a drink at by candlelight. Yeah, let's do that. That sounds romantic. Christmas light. Here you go. I wanted to talk to you about a couple things. Andy, will you marry me? No. <laughs> no, I will not. Okay. Well, I'm already married. So okay. You couldn't even if you wanted to. <laughs> Immediately gets defensive. <laughs> well, I didn't want to anyway. So. <laughs> All right, this is Spark. This is Mountain Dew Spark. This is their their lemonade kind of. Oh, okay. uh, raspberry lemonade. You poured a lot. Oh, this me. is weird. This smells funky monkey. Oh man, this is a carbonated minute made. This is delicious. No, it's got a weird taste to it, man. They got they put some great. Like, oh, it's lemon. Raspberry lemonade. Yeah, I don't like the raspberry. This is horrible. This is so good. This is god awful to me. Man, I'm freaking power. Can't believe we went out. I know, it's a bummer. It's still raining though outside. Pretty nice. When I mean, you could just kind of sit here and take in the Remember when you were a kid and it was a rainy day? And it was like a Saturday and you're like, I can't go out and play, I just play video games all day. And your mom's like, I don't feel like cooking, I'm just gonna go order pizza. And then your dad came home with an ax. And just said, <laughs> oh my God. one of you has to go. And then he put the ax in the middle and you had to fight your mom with the ax. No, I, I don't remember that actually. Me neither. Okay. okay. Uh, I'm gonna put this I don't like this. I, I, I'm gonna put this right above the flaming hot. I'm cool with that. Yeah, I don't think it's very good. So we're gonna start. I'm cool with it. Like I like it a lot. I just don't think it's. We're gonna move this back over here to the back tier. This is gonna go over here, Mike. I don't know if you can still see these or not to rank, but this is gonna Spark go. Spark goes underneath purple thunder. Underneath purple thunder, everything moves down, dudes. All right, cool. Great job. Oof, this gets scary out here, yeah. man. Oh, you know what this reminds me of, Andy? Did you ever watch the Never Ending Story? No. Me neither. Oh. All right, next up, okay. Mountain Dew Voltage. Next this up. one was real tough to find. I'm so glad I was able to find it. And I'm excited about this one because this one was a hard one for you to get. And again, a nice color. I think it's a blue or a purple. Not yeah, quite sure. This is lighting. so Nick. Let me just tell you, like back in the day, Code Red and Voltage were like the OG non-originals. You know now what I mean? This has some good carbonation to it. Yeah, I'm hearing you. I mean, yeah, it's good carbonation. I just bought it. Cool. Well. <laughs> Voltage, Voltage is going to rank very high for me right now. I can tell you that much. You smell it first. We'll do a smell test. Oh, man. Yes. Yes. I'm not mad at it. Fuck yeah, dude. I would put this. God damn, dude. I would put this right underneath. Oh, the, the emergency light kind of came on a oh, little bit. Oh, that's interesting. <laughs> it's cool. I like it. I would put this right underneath. Baja Blast. I would put this underneath Bomb Pop. Uh, we have to bring Mike in now. Mike, this is a. Drink the rest of mine, dude. Just. But though you don't got to put your lips on it. You can just shot it. Oh, man. He put his whole mouth on it. Yeah, he, he shot that oh, like a sorority. He girl licked a control the other day. Of course, he'd drink that. Ooh, that's very good. Voltage is my favorite. And where are you putting yours? I'm putting, I would put it underneath Baja Blast. Like right, right above Baja Blast. Number five. I'd put it over the OG. Six. I think the OG is way too high right now. There are so many better options than the OG. You're fucking high. You're high. You're high on fucking high. <laughs> <laughs> I will agree with the dude, Andy Cortez. Yes. Where are you going to put it? Underneath Bomb Pop. I don't get my work out here. Underneath Bomb Pop. Oh, thank you. The backup generator came oh, back on. got the backup generator. That's good to know. Well, 
Well, that's perfect. I mean, while we deal with the rest of the rankings, Nick. You um, want it above the original? Yeah, above the OG. There we go. Uh, let's let's take a break right now. Let's get that. Let's get the power sorted out because yeah. Andy, I have it on good authority. We have a special message from the man himself. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. Straight from the North Pole, Santa Claus has given us a message oh, to wish us a very happy Christmas in July and August. Let's take a listen. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. And a happy do year. Ho! Oh! Ho! Oh! Ho! KFAF! Boys and girls! What? <laughs> it's not Santa, it's me! It's me! Ronald McDonald, here to tell you the good news. <laughs> Merry Christmas in July and August. <laughs> I've missed you. 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 Uncle Ronald's missed a lot of holidays, hasn't he, Timothy? Hasn't he? Hasn't he? Hasn't he, Timothy? So many souls taken. <laughs> a lot of people. A lot of people. Uh, a lot of people. I've been worshiping a false god. Grimace. 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 Ronald McDonald. Ronald McDonald misses a few holidays. Ronald McDonald misses a few holidays. That's what changes a man. But is Ronald a man? Grimace? <laughs> Why? What is wrong with you people? Your bald pussies and cocks. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Mick rewards. Oh my god. 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 <laughs> if ants are so smart, why don't they drive cars? <laughs> <laughs> Do you think Jesus was cognizant for everything? Fucking shit's gonna be better than this, 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 better than this. Oh. The holidays come but once a year, once a year, once a year. The holidays come but once a year. No more pussies and cocks. <laughs> Do you think that when I look at your cheeks, I can't go and say, oh, there it is the little downstairs areola that everybody can see. Cause you've been spreading them every day, haven't you? What do you want for Christmas, Andy? What do you want for Christmas, Andy? <laughs> Where can I kiss you, Andy? What do you want for Christmas, Andy? <laughs> Why do this to yourselves? Why limit the holidays to two months? <laughs> Thanksgiving? <laughs> Christmas. Have you ever thought about that? What words are in Christmas? <laughs> Mucho Christ. <laughs> well, this isn't Taco Bell. All right, you won't live moss in my house. <sighs> Barbara Bush. Barbara Bush! <laughs> okay. That was not... Not what I expected from Santa Claus. I'm very shocked. I'm, uh, 
Um, where, where's Santa Claus then? If I, I, you know, it, that looked eerily like it was our bathrooms here in the studio. Hmm. So that means that Ronald's floating around here somewhere, and I guess he has a really big bone to pick with Barbara Bush. I don't know why. There was a theme there of bushes and then bald things. I didn't expect him to show up again. For <sighs> very shocking. Mucho Christ, though. Mucho Christ, indeed, Andy. Mucho Christ. Andy, you know what'll wash the taste of that package out of our mouth? Oh. Our next flavor. Major Melon. Oh, Major Melon. Now, I like this can. A ten I like hut. this canister. Captain? This this was one of their uh, one of their kind of like main flavors. Wait, is this pro is this military propaganda? Is this trying to recruit young children into our armed services? I don't think so. No, it's just trying to get people into watermelon. Because okay. I've said it before, watermelon the the worst candy. We can Ooh, all agree. That is a deep pink. We can oh, all dude. agree. Whoa. Water watermelon the worst candy. They don't make enough pineapple candies. I agree. Banana as well. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, this is a good Major color. Melon. Ooh, I don't know about that. This is a good color right here. That, I don't know about that. Oh, God. It's what it smells like. Oh, that's horrible. You don't like it. I don't like watermelon things. What did I tell you? <laughs> it's watermelon -y. What did I tell you? Balls, pussies, and cocks. Balls, pussies, and cocks, indeed. <laughs> What was he saying? Bush. What was Nick he rewards. saying? What was he saying? A lot of things got said there. <laughs> we hashed out a lot of things, and, and dare I say, I think we started a lot of beefs. Mm. What got edited out? <laughs> I'm Not worried. I don't a know lot. Why. I don't even want to ask. A lot I'm, got edited out. I don't want to ask. Um, hmm. Mike, do you want a, the rest of this shot? Let me take it to you. I, I got to be honest with you. I think we put this right below this purpley one right here. Ooh. What do you think about that? Dudes. I'm going to put it like right here. Right below below Purple Thunder? Yeah. I can rock with that. I'd go below Purple Thunder as well. It's fine. It's watermelon. I see the merits. I get it. If you like watermelon, you're going to love that. If Barrett likes watermelon, he can drink all of that right now. Mm -hmm. But if it's pineapple based, I would have had it. Yeah. Totally agree. All right. There's your front row. I don't even want to drink the rest of this. It's disgusting, but I will. <gasps> oh. Oh my God. It's scary. What's happening? Are we in October? Oh, wow, it's... Is it Halloween time? I guess it's time to celebrate some other holidays here, which I thought this is Christmas in July and August, but... But like a... Santa said, why choose only one holiday why... when you can have all the holidays? There's so many of them, Nick, yeah. Next up on our list is the 2019 Voodoo flavor. Yeah, Mo Mountain Dew sent me a package of... of all of the flavors recently, yeah. like... Hey, here's the one from 2019 and 2020 and 2021 and 2022. So these next four are all going to be the holiday, the, the Halloween uh, flavors. So let's, okay. let's check them out. Drink the rest of that. Drink your poison. Getting a little spooky with Drink it. Drink your medicine. There you go. Okay. Let's get spooky with it. Like Will Smith once said, getting spooky with it. Nah, 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 nah. Getting spooky with it. Nah, 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 nah. Oh, this is like clear. On your mark where he said, let's go. Dance on phone. I know you know. I know. Oh, this is clear. Yeah. yeah so this these. Is clear. So these. Uh, sort of that little promotion. Like, can you guess the flavor? And if you do. Oh. Wowie zowie. Is that good? I've never tasted these. I think it's cotton candy, or is that marshmallow? The marshmallow? No. What is this? Who are you? Who are you? You're in my mouth, and I don't know who you are. I've never met you before. Hey, stranger. Can we introduce can, yourself? Can can we? Uh, can you Google on your phone 2019 mystery flavor? This Arizona. is good. I like this though. I like it. I want it to be said right now. I want it to be clear so that people don't don't misunderstand me. It tastes like the or the cream filling in an Oreo. Orange creamsicle is what Siegfried is yes, saying. Yes, it's creamsicle. That's what it is. That's. Yeah, 2019. Yeah, 2019. Our, our... Oh, candy corn. Oh. I mean, somewhere in the middle there. I like this a lot. This is delicious. Thank you for our top men. I'm going to put this... Man. I don't want to drink a lot of it, though. That's the thing. I, I don't see want a whole cup saying. of it. I see what you're saying. You know? I would go... Um, like, I, I wouldn't want to give this to I would child. go above melon. All right. Put it there. I would go above melon. 
I, I can't see now. this being a regular drink for me. I agree with no, you. No, that's a fun like. That's a great we point try it at a party. You. We dare each other to kiss each other in the in the you know the, the hall tree closet, yeah. and then we go home just with our thoughts. Next up, yeah, try that. Give that a swig, Mike. Mystery Please. flavor 2020. Yeah, not bad, right? Not bad. But not again, terrible. not really like a regular type. They're having fun, dudes. They I are. Like that. They are. Yeah, they are over Does there. Does it scare you that they can make all these drinks without the color? If they wanted to? I kind of feel like the color has to be there, and when they don't, I'm just like, what sort of like dark sciences are you working what with? What voodoo right magic are you yeah. using on my brain? Here we go, number 2020. The year of the devil. Oh, God. That's the cream skull one. That's this the is the cream skull one. Oh, oh, I that like, like this. No, that's oh god, that's like car cleaner. <laughs> I like that's this. That's horrible. Oh, I was that's, way off. That's horrible. Fruit candy. It tastes. You know what it tastes like? Starburst. Fruit a candy. Car Skittles. Air, Explosion a car air is what they call it. No, it smells like it. T it tastes like Skittles. Tastes this shit, Mike. This tastes like Skittles. Oh god, that's horrible. I'm putting that below the other one. This is totally Skittles. Yeah. It is Skittles. It's horrible. This is great. I'm putting it below. I really like this one. I'm, oh, I have you're already drinking 2020. And I'm chugging oh, this. Oh, nice. I like this one. Where do you want to put it? Yeah. Um, above or below the other one? Above Thrashed Apple. Yes. Yeah. Okay. All right. It's going to fuck it up down. Mike's ranking. I'm sorry, Mike, but I think Kick it goes it above Thrashed Apple. Okay. That is good, dude. Mike doing the most work on this show right now. Mike in his body. Wait, where did these go? Okay, he's back here. Okay. Yeah. That's good. Uh, all right, next up, mystery flavor, 2021. Should have known that one. <laughs> it's in a row, goes yeah. in a Kind of goes in a in an order that is dependable. Let me get a little squeak ski of that. Remember last time when we ended the rankings, I poured a lot of them into one cup and drank them all? We're going to do that today. Oh. I'm going to make you a big cup of all these. <laughs> cool. All right, this is 2020. 2021, 2021, everybody. The year of the devil. Oh, wow. That's good. What is this in my mouth? Called That's good. Can so this is a Starburst. This is good. Fuck. Man, these guys are masters, dude. I like that a lot, actually. I'm going to put that probably above this. Right below this Baja Blast, I think. How do you feel about that? I like it. Again, I don't want a full can of it, but I'll I'll fuck that up with a cocktail. Like, that'd be good in a cocktail. You put some vodka in that oh bad boy, God. We, we kick back with that thing. We should do that. Let's do it. We should figure out a way to do that. A vodka. All right, Sorry, last Mike. up on the we voodoo list is... 2020 uh, below Baja Blast at number eight. Just stick it in there. Fuck yeah, it's a good car right just there. Just shove it in, Mike. No, just shove it in, Mike. Mike's a man of his yeah, word. Yeah, shove it in there. I'm a man of my word. This is great. Right. This is the, so this is the the most recent one. This is from Halloween last year. This is year. 2022. I can't wait for Halloween this year. I love Halloween. Halloween of last year. Let's check it out. Okay, here you go. Beep, 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 beep. Here's. Here we go. Ooh. Uh. Oh, I like that. Oh. That's a Sour Patch Kid. That's a Sour Patch Sour Kid. Sour Patch Kid. That's good as fuck. This that is, would be great with vodka. In this it. is weird to me. It's That's so good. sour. Oh, no, it's good. It's. So, I'm surprised you like this. Mm. That's the most like underdog thing ever. This is the most like. That's real good to me. I would have assumed that you would have hated this shit. You know what it reminds me of, Andy? When you let me eat your candy in movies. Mm. It's very nostalgic. I, mean, I, I don't really let you. You just kind of like. I just reach over and grab whatever yeah. <laughs> in your hands. Yeah, you should do. Ooh. I like it. Mike, I need you to tie, tie break me because I want to I want to rank this above all the other voodoos. Mike, let me give you a little You got it, dude. Thanks, dude. Ooh, that's got a punch to it it's, right there. It's that's a good. sour, right? It's like a... I, I would put it above... No, yep. I would put it real low. Right in the middle. Okay. Right smack dab in the middle. Oh, that was exactly what I was thinking, Mike. Yep. They won. Exactly they won. what I was thinking. Oh, God, it's so sour. What the fuck? It's, uh, it feels unnatural. So much of this feels unnatural. All right. In, we're done with Halloween, Nick, okay? We're done with the Halloween vibes. Can we just... Wait, get, is that... Do I see the sun? 
Can we, just, is it springtime? Oh, the power's back up. Oh, power's back up. It's not scary can, anymore. Can, thank God. Uh, enough with that with that season. It's Christmas time in July and August. Let's get back to the reason for the season. Jesus Christ. This one uh, is flavored after the body of Christ. Fruit quake. Oh, fruit quake. Yep. Fruit quake. They sent me fruit cake last year uh, in December, a couple of months ago. Fruit quake. The body of Christ compels you. It's like half a year ago now. Our final Why do I think it's February? <laughs> <laughs> I have no idea what time it is. I don't know where we are, and apparently we're on the third floor. Here we go. Fruit and quake. somewhere around here is Ronald McDonald. This is a weird one, because how this the looks hell... This shit. This looks like pine salt. How the hell can they... You know, I'm getting a lot of cranberry vibe. Because when I think no. fruitcake, I think of, like, obviously breading and stuff. That doesn't make sense for a liquid. You're pouring way too much, by the way. You gotta... We're almost done. <laughs> in for a penny, in for a pound. In for a penny, in for a pound. Oh, God. Dead last. Oh, it's just apple juice. Dead last. No. There's something else there. I'll put it last. This I never is... want that again. I never want that There's again. There's like an aftertaste to this. There's something wonky about that. Are you that. feeling that's that? That's cattywampus for sure. Oh, yeah. That's my least favorite so far. All right. Honestly, like, the only real miss so far. The frost was terrible. No. Summer, the summer frost was bad. No, it wasn't bad. It was just whatever. All right, Andy. The final one. The final, the final ranking. Ginger snapped. Gingerbread snapped. Ginger snapped. Let's we'll see if this, this can one. wash the taste of that god-awful fruit quake out oh, of our Oh, good. Mouth. It's still got carbonation. It does, thank God. That's good. And it's still kind of cold. <laughs> kind of surprised by that. <laughs> Here we go. To go well with some Taco Bell. And yes, chat, uh, chat was asking how cold are these? They've been in the fridge all night. They're pretty cold. Yeah. It's not like Taco Bell. We're like, oh, you got you to gotta get the crunch wraps pretty warm. Get out of here. Yeah. All right. Final mm -hmm. one. Here Bottoms up, dude. Cheers. To 20 years in the KFAF. making. KFAF. 20 years of KFAF. Whoa. <laughs> That's fucking weird. That's weird. That's you know what that is. Mm. You could taste like gingerbread. Yeah, that's a ginger. That's but a it, gingerbread. But cookie. it doesn't throw me off. Doesn't I don't hate it. I don't it's love like a it. brown sugar. You mix this with a little bourbon. Yes. A little ice, a little bourbon. A little fireball. A little fireball. That'd be pretty good. This is so wild. That's wild, honey. This is really really weird, Mike. You want to? Oh yeah, try this, Mike. Mm. It's like it the the scent. Wafts in your face, like that smells good, dude. You can smell the freaking gingerbread. I feel good too. Mm. Mm. Oh, but I wouldn't want this for a regular drink. No, though. I'm gonna put this. I would put this below flame and hot. Below flame and hot. That's a great way. That's a great place to put it. So, Mike, this is gonna go I'm third to, to last. Out. And we've had a lot of sugar. And I'm, I'm very scared. Out. Should we Are, check in on our final rankings as soon as Mike is done? Putting them on the board, or do you want to make one mega drink for you? Oh shit, did I miscount them? Is there 21? There's a lot. Yeah, there was 21. Oh, my bad. <laughs> <laughs> Either that or Mike missed a couple in there somewhere, but it looks no, like one, yeah, two. Yeah, I definitely missed. I definitely fucked up. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. Yeah, it's fine. We have a bonus flavor, which is that the ginger Oh, snack. you know what? Voltage is for number 14 twice. Voltage of Major Mail, and I have that. I, I wrote it wrong over there. So yeah, 21 flavors. Baskin Robbins. All right. Do, we want, do, you, do you want me to make you a mega cocktail? Yeah, a whole, I'd love a that. A glass of it? I would love that, yeah. Barrett, could you do me a favor and grab me just a glass with a little bit of ice in it <laughs> for Andy? To make me, <laughs> I want to make a so big much. cocktail for you of all of these drinks right now. I think, yeah, maybe I can sip on that when we hop into the final segment of the day. That sounds good. Can we do that now? Sure. We're Is coming. it time? No, no. Oh, okay. No, no, we're good. <laughs> oh, so I want to watch Mike do this. Mike, check your body. That we're fools. He cuts a mic. There it is. We don't make the rules. We're gonna do the deuce. Maybe we'll boo. Watch out with the hammy, though. Careful. It is time to rank the deuce. Look at him move. Do the deuce. Maybe we'll boo the deuce. God, he's so it good. It is time to rank the deuce. Dudes. He Couple is the dudes. 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 Mike Couple is my dude. dude. I need food to like absorb, to absorb it. everything. <laughs> the final rankings are as follows. Can I start from number 21? You can absolutely. Number 21? Fruit Quake. Go, ahead, go for it. Number 20, Mountain Dew Frostbite. Horrible. God awful. Number 19, Flamin' Hot. Flamin' Hot. Flamin' Hot. 
Number 18, Gingerbread Snapped. Number 17, Mountain Dew Spark. 16, Major Melon. 15, Voodoo 2019. Number 14 is Purple Thunder. There it is right there. Number 13 is Caribbean Punch Baja Blast. Number 12 is uh, Caribbean Splat or Punch something Splash. It's really tough to read over here. What does that say, Mike? That's Caribbean Splash. Oh, the other one was Passion Fruit Punch. Caribbean. Caribbean Splash was in, uh, Caribbean. <laughs> Uh, was number 12. 11 is Thrashed Apple. Number 10, Voodoo from 2020. Number 9 is Voodoo from 2021. Number 8 is Voodoo from 2022. Number 7, Baja Blast. Number 6, Uproar. Kind of an upset with Uproar there, being the Kiwi Berry. Number 5, Sweet Lightning. Number 4, the OG, where it all started. Number 3, Voltage. Number two, Summer Freeze, and number one, Code Red. Kevin, you were right on it. You were right the fuck on it. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. That is our official do ranking, but as is our way, such is our custom, we're going to now mix all these together and try one mega cocktail, starting with number one. I'm just going to do them all. I like it. I like it, yeah. I'm do them all. A little splash just like, Just a little splashes here little and there. Splash. That. Maybe splash, not all dude. of them, because that's going to take a little while, but I'll do this. Well, um, here's the thing. I can, mix, mix, the I can mix them all if you want to read the get the question started from Ask Andy Anything. You know what? I can do that. Now it's time to Ask Andy Anything. Ask Andy Anything. Andy. Our first reader question for today comes from, of course, the fine people over on Patreon. Remember, folks, if you want to support us, go to kindoffunny.com. Nope, patreon.com slash kindoffunny. Back us at any of those fun tiers that you can back us at. Really appreciate it. It's Patreon Pledge Month. If you guys want to get out there and throw us a couple bucks, that'd be great. But also just watching this and commenting about how good I look, that goes a long way, too. And special thanks to anyone that comments anywhere. Hashtag Greg sucks. Mm -hmm. This comes from... Hello, Jamie. We'll be chatting with you all in the comments, so go, go talk to us there. Jamie says, okay, so it's the year 2025. Mike is dying from blindness and lack of trying the most common foods in America. Also, Nick, at the same time, is also dying, obviously due to old age. You have one vial of that water from the water boy. Who do you give it to? Oof. Really tough. Because, like... Like, I don't really like either of you very much. Mm -hmm. Like, you know, I love you all, but I don't really like you all. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. um, and I feel like if... Here's the thing. I would give it to Nick only because if I offered it to Mike, Mike would say, I'm fine, Sappy. I'm fine. Don't worry about me. Don't worry about me. I don't need the vial. I'd be like, Mike, you're, you're going to die right now. I know that for a fact you will be dying. I'll be fine, Sappy. Don't worry about me. So, like, it would be a lost cause to use it on him. Yeah. So I would give it to Nick. You know, that is the correct answer. Mm -hmm. One point. And then also Mike would find a way to stay alive. He'd go to <laughs> he'd get into heaven and he'd he'd look for God and be like, God, here's the thing. Here's the thing, bro. And he and suddenly he'd be like, yeah, I'm talking to a big man upstairs, you he know, and he'd make his way back on Earth. He just walks right past the pearly gates. Yeah. And Peter's like, what's up, Mike? He's like, what's up, PP? Yeah. <laughs> and then he's all of a sudden he's not he's in the ring at WrestleMania. He it's would just he would just know everybody up there and he would find his way back on Earth. So like, why would I? save him when he's just going to come back to earth somehow anyway just like you can't keep him out of a vip section you can't keep him in the afterlife hey dudes can we just look at that drink really quick <laughs> it's like, appreciate it's, the color coming out of this it's gotten it's gotten puke green <laughs> it looks like a like the the naked green drink the the green energy or the uh the one that's like it's got a bunch of celery and shit you know Next question comes from longtime listener, first time caller, Ignacia Rojas. Because I want your opinion on a debate that oh, has been Ignacia. raging across the whole world for eons. For Christmas, did you stay up at night, the night of the 24th, and open gifts at midnight, or should you wait until the morning of the 25th? Well, we know, Ignacio, that I am Mexican, and that's just what we do. I didn't know people did gifts on Christmas Day until I started watching Christmas movies. Because, mm. like, Christmas Eve has just always been the time you do it. It's always been a Christmas Eve thing, and then you wake up, and then you eat food, and then you open gifts from like relatives you maybe didn't see at Christmas Eve. You yeah. Know? So that's usually 
the thing that that we do after we we go to church and then we would go to my grandma's house and then we would all open gifts there and the next day we'd have a big turkey lunch or whatever and then you'd see hey tia how's it going tia she'd be here you go mijo i got you a little gift card from whataburger or whatever so yeah should I be concerned that it's the coloring's melting the ice faster than it's supposed to melt it? Yeah, I don't. The the ice is having a rough time. Okay. Uh, what do you think? That looks got no, It's actually turning open, clear no, now. No opening which is gifts. Low. Opening gifts. Oh, I like to open one gift on Christmas Eve and then the rest of the gifts on Christmas Day. Mm. That's what we like to do. But I always knew what, what gifts I was getting because my brother and I couldn't wait, so we'd sneak into my parents' room and unwrap like a little bit of it so we could see what we were getting. Oh, I like that. That's yeah, cute. That was fun. That's really this cute. is a bonus question. For Nick, how was it celebrating Jesus' birth back when he was still alive? <laughs> That's a good question. How was it? <laughs> how was it, uh, big fella? <laughs> Tell you one thing about big guy. <laughs> hey, big guy. <laughs> All right, Nick, bottoms Let's up. Move right along. Oh, is this it? Bottoms up. All right. That's going to do it, ladies and gentlemen, for Ask Andy Anything. That's going to do it for our show today. Before we go, one final cheers to everyone who came out to support us today, who waited three years to celebrate Christmas in July and August for us. Special thanks to the dude over there and everyone Dudes. that contributed to the show. Joey, Roger, Kevin, Barrett, Ronald McDonald himself. Mm -hmm. and I'm sure Tim did something. Let's try this right now before we go. Brown. Delicious. You know what? Not that bad. Pretty good. Not that bad. Pretty good. <laughs> Until next time, ladies and gentlemen, I've been Nick. I've been Andy. And you've just been... AF'd.